We welcome you to St. Peter and Paul's Catholic Church here in Huntington, Indiana. And some of you have asked for an update on how the progress here on the grounds has been going. Of course, many updates are given through the bulletin and Facebook, but it has been about a year since we've had one of these videos, and much has happened in this year for all of us. In a productive way, you can see that instead of a lot of dirt and mud, there, the grass is coming in quite beautifully, and the rectory has had a new siding put on, and we await some gutters and some improved lighting. You see here also this cement pad. That's going to be a fire pit, and we look forward to many activities happening around the parish some of them fairly soon. On Tuesday evenings, the young adults are invited to join us, anyone 20 to 30 years of age on Tuesday nights, and then anyone 30 and over on Thursday nights. Of course, Tuesday and Thursday, we always have the 7 p.m. Mass, so if you're inclined to, join us for that Mass, and then age appropriately, join us on Tuesday and Thursday evenings for a fire pit in conversation. So much to look forward to and so forth. And further out around the grounds, you can see our parking lot is now complete. As promised, this is a parking lot for 19 parking spaces. You do not have to have a handicap tag to park here, but instead this is a parking spaces of convenience. Those who are not able to walk up steps and so forth, this would be an excellent opportunity for you to park here and then go up the gradual incline sidewalk and then avail yourself to the handicapped door and gain access to the church that way. So we hope that you can use these parking spots for your safety and for your entrance into church for those that need it. Also, we see here the new building is now complete. It's been used on various occasions. It is available to be rented if you call the parish office. You can rent it as you used to, Father Gallner Hall and the auditorium. Those two places will be also available in the future. But as with right now, we're protecting those spaces as we continue to help one another during the closing, we pray, of this pandemic. So this room here at the new uh, building is available for rent. Again, if you just call the parish office, the ladies can help you there. It's a capacity of 49 individuals, but of course you have the parking lot that you can have a little bit of overflow of guests, you know, having a bowl of ice cream or favorite beverage and so forth. You also see the three um, garage doors there. The first one closest to the double windows, that service door and the overhead door is for our maintenance bin. That's where they keep the tractor and the plow and so forth like that. And then the other two doors are uh, the pastor, my car spot, as well as an empty one for any future individuals that might be here, like, an, like a seminarian or a visiting priest and so forth. As we continue this video, I hope that you enjoy these updates and we'll meet you at the playground. Something new to our area here is the playground. We're very, very happy with it and it has been a great community builder here in the neighborhood and it's been a tremendous asset for all of our students to play on whether you're an in, maybe, maybe you're in eighth grade or the preschoolers, there's something on the playground for everyone to enjoy. There's five different slides. Some of them are dual, so you can have a little friendly competition race and so forth, but it's a great asset to our parish. Obviously, it's adjacent to our new building, our air conditioned building, obviously, and from the windows of the uh, new building, you can overlook the playground, so perhaps you're having an anniversary party, retirement party, so forth. You can watch the grandchildren, the nieces and nephews, you know, having fun outside while you're enjoying the air-conditioned room.